Hello people. I have news. I've been published. Like, okay, so I've been published before. But today, I was published in print. Physical print. Not digital print. Not online. Lost amongst the masses. But in the local newspaper. Oh, here it is. There's my name. So I've actually been published a lot this year. If you follow me on Twitter, you'll know that earlier, like Friday, in fact, I had my first academic essay published in New Myths, which was also really exciting. It was originally an essay I wrote for my master's degree, so to be able to reuse it and be paid for it and know that people are reading it beyond my teachers is really satisfying. It can be very easy to forget that you're doing better or improving or even succeeding at something like writing, especially when you're starting out. So last year was the first year really that I was a writer. I don't know why I used air quotes, that's weird. But last year was the first time I ever had anything published. This year I've been published seven or eight times, maybe even more. And that's like, if you look at like the percentage increase, I'm not going to work it out because I'm not that quick at maths, but that's quite a dramatic increase. Because I want to make a career out of this, that can put added stress, say financially, on my success as a writer and my publications. So it can very easily feel like I'm not doing well, I'm not working hard enough, I'm not achieving enough, that I'm failing. It, even though I'm being published, which I sometimes doubted would ever happen, I sometimes feel like I'm failing. And so I think it's important, really so important to just like take a step back and look at how you've improved, how you've grown, and how you're succeeding. This is a success. Being published at all is a massive success. And keeping on writing is a massive success. It's hard. You're rejected a lot. You feel like a failure a lot. And you still have to pay the bills somehow. So making time to write and keeping on doing it is a win. Celebrate it. <laughs> and that's what I wanted to share with you today. Yeah. Sorry, that was really, really creepy and unnecessary.